6 tips that can help you become better at path animation. Path property is one of the key concepts in Adobe After Effects. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you 6 tricks that can increase your skill with path animation. Tip number 1. If you want to turn a shape layer into a path property, navigate through the shape and then right click on it and select convert to Bezier path. Now, instead of selecting the path in the shape menu, there is a better shortcut for it. With your selection tool selected, hold Ctrl and click on shape layer. This will select all of the transform property of the shape layer. Now, just hold Shift and click on the path to select it and manipulate it however you want. Tip number two. If you have a layer with multiple shape layers inside it, and you want to set a keyframe for each property path, just don't open each layer and set a keyframe on path. Now, instead, press G to go towards the pen tool and click on a point. And then switch to selection tool by pressing V and then select everything. Now, go towards the edit and select cut. And then navigate through the shape layer in content section, select one of the contents and then press Ctrl plus V to paste the path. Now, delete the rest of the layers. Now you have every path on one layer. Pay close attention to the layer hierarchy as the shape layer should be above all of the layers. Tip number three. If you have a problem with changing the handles and they seem to be small, go towards the edit menu and go towards the preferences and then select general. Change the path points and handle size to 10 or more pixels. Now you can select the handles and work better with them. Well now, this is where I would like you to hit that like and subscribe button. This will help me out a lot to grow the channel and your support helps me to get more views on YouTube. Now about the tip number 4. If you have a shape path and you want to change one side of the handles, just select the pen tool and then hold alt and just click on the handle. This will allow you to only work with one side of the path handles. And now if you want to revert it back. Just grab the handle and hold ALT again. Tip number 5. If you have a shape path and you want to animate an object along the shape path, just navigate through the shape path and then copy the path by pressing CTRL plus C. And then open the object position by pressing P and then paste it by pressing CTRL plus V. Now the object moves along the path. But to orient it along the path, select the object and then go towards the layer. In transform, select auto orient. And then change the auto orientation to orient along the path. Lastly, fix the rotation. Now, tip number six. As you already know, the loop expressions such as cycle, ping pong, offset, and etc. are not working on the path property. But next time, you can copy this expression to your path property to loop your animation. Now, here we are at the end of this video, and I hope you have enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. I see you in the next one.